you doing? I'm Duncan Smith, and I want to talk to you about the importance of the takeaway in your backswing. Getting the takeaway right is really the first thing you can do to give you the best chance of making the best downswing, and it's something you really don't want to overlook. Most people uh, struggling coming over the top drag the club way mu too much to the inside going back, and as a consequence, bring it down too steep hitting your iron shots fat, hit slicing your driver. So, one thing you can really focus on is just getting that takeaway perfect. So just use an alignment stick, put it on your feet line here, and just practice moving the club back until it's parallel with the ground, and try to keep the club head slightly outside your hands. Notice I'm not rolling it with my forearms to the inside, or taking it too far out. My checkpoint is, is as I take the club back, I get the club parallel with the ground, the club head is slightly to the outside of my hands. This is going to give me the best chance to bring the club all the way up and then drop it on a slightly flatter plane, bringing the club more shallow into the ball, which is going to give you your best contact and distance. Okay, so it's really good to just rehearse the takeaway a few times. taking it back and parallel with the ground, the club slightly outside my hands. That's going to give me the best opportunity to bring the club up on the right plane and then drop it onto a slightly more shallow plane. It's going to give me my best contact and my straightest shot. Work on this tip at home and on the range. Don't overlook the takeaway. It will give you the best opportunity at getting the right downswing and hitting your best shots.